Five calibers you need to have in your arsenal. 5.56, five, 9 millimeter, 22 long rifle, a 30 caliber, and a 12 gauge shotgun. First caliber you should have in your arsenal is the 5.56, five, specifically in the AR-15 platform, the most popular rifle in America. Big benefits of the AR-15, your ability to customize it to fit your needs, its effectiveness out to 600 meters, it's relatively low recoil, and your ability to carry a lot of ammunition. In addition to that, parts availability, third-party accessories, optics, stocks. If you can only have one firearm, you want to have an AR-15 chambered in 5.56. The second caliber you should have in your arsenal is a 9mm, specifically in the format of a compact handgun. The beauty of the 9mm is it's a proven self-defense round, relatively low recoil, you carry a lot of rounds, and there are just so many manufacturers that make 9mm handguns, you are bound to find one that works for you. Additionally, in contrast to all the other firearms we have on that table, this is the only one that you can carry concealed. A 9mm compact handgun is a must-have in your arsenal. Third caliber you have in your arsenal is 22 long rifle. It makes 22 long rifle a great round, has virtually no recoil, which makes it a great round to learn on. It's also very inexpensive ammunition, and it's also very light ammunition. The other great thing about 22 long rifle is it's a ubiquitous round, so there's a lot of manufacturers out there. You can build a 22 long rifle to fit your needs, your body type. In addition to all that, 22 long rifle is what we call the quintessential survival round and we'll have another video that talks all about that but um, you can't go wrong with having a 22 long rifle in your safe in fact you need one fourth caliber you should have in your arsenal is a 30 caliber this one in particular is a 308 762 by 51 it doesn't have to be a 308 there's a lot of great 30 caliber cartridges out there 30 caliber is good when you need an extended range or terminal ballistics when you compare it to 5.56. The fifth caliber you should have in your arsenal is 12 gauge. The beauty about 12 gauge is you can tailor that shell to fit a variety of use cases, whether it's from birdshot to buckshot to slugs. You can take small game with a 12 gauge, and you can breach a door with a right 12 gauge. One thing to keep in mind though, is uh, the form factor of a 12 gauge shotgun greatly affects its performance and therefore its use case. Uh, here we have a 28 inch over under. Um, the purpose of this 12 gauge is gonna be vastly different than say an 18 inch bullpup uh, tactical shotgun. So that's something to keep in mind, the barrel length, the chokes, uh, the different sizes of these shotguns are much greater in their performance when compared to say a 10.3 AR versus a 14.5 AR. Yeah, those, are, those two rifles have different performances as well, but it's gonna be magnified when you start dealing with different uh, forms of shotguns.